The mother of three is showing her fellow matriarchs how to step out. Cardi B has been dealing with quite a lot over the last couple of months or so. The superstar rapper is split once again from Offset, who is now a father to three of her children. She delivered a healthy baby girl on September 12th, despite dealing with some health scares in the process. Most recently, she unintentionally added a lawsuit to her plate, which is in relation to one of her newer singles, like what, Freestyle. The owner of the California mansion in the video sent some legal documents to her and Offset, director of the visuals, for essentially lying to them about why they were renting the place. He claims that their teams reached out to him that an anonymous client was looking to film a TikTok. The homeowner waived the fee because of that. So, he's suing them for not paying any of the fees. Cardi B responded with great fervor, showing that she feels her and Set got this case in the bag. So, yes, she's been through a lot, but now she's getting to enjoy some me time at Paris Fashion Week. The autumn run is here, and it kicked off this past Monday, September 23, according to TMZ Hip Hop. Not only is Cardi B in attendance for it, but she's also showing out in a grand way. There are some pictures slash videos of the New York native in a bougie gold sequined and fringe dress. The garment is made by Paco Rabanne, and she is absolutely eating it up. You can tell by her big and inviting smile in the photos, as well as with the video she shared to X, Twitter. This is her first public appearance since giving birth not too long ago, but you can barely tell. She's also been spotted in a flowy and sexy dark green dress as well, making it clear she's ready to slay the other celeb guests. What are your thoughts on Cardi B's gold dress at Paris Fashion Week? Do you think this is her best look yet? Why or why not? What's been your favorite look from her so far at this season's week of fashion? We would like to hear what you have to say, so leave your thoughts in the comments.